Hey guys, what is up? Today I'm going to be showing you how to install the X-Ray mod for Minecraft 1.6.4. Now, uh, before we get started, we need to download two things and install a program. So, uh, the program will just allow us to open zips and then the two other things are the mod files. So, to download them, uh, what you want to do is visit the description and the link under downloads should be called X-Ray and you just want to click that. And then below that somewhere, there should be a WinRAR link, and you want to click that as well. And uh, if you're installing this mod on a later update, make sure that the installation hasn't changed and that the mod itself hasn't updated. I mean, has updated. But, uh, you can check that by just in this box, there should be which update it's on. So if it's on a low update, then it won't work. And uh, if the installation's changed, it won't work either. So uh, don't complain if you're on a, you know, if them things come into mind. So uh, on the WinRAR link you just want to download the right version and then just install it. I'm not going to show you how to do that because it's really easy. You just basically go with it, press next, next, you know. So basically here you just want to go down until you see download and uh, here you have the option to get the fly mod as well since it's not like one thing. But uh, if you're getting the fly mod you can't just have it on its own. You have to as it says here, you have to have the X-Ray mod in order for that to work. So to get the X-Ray mod, you just want to click download for 1.6.4. So just click that and uh, it should take you to minecraftprojects.net. And uh, right down here, it should say download. And uh, in these brackets, it should say X-Ray mod 1.6.4. You just want to click there. And that should take you to Nickcraft. And uh, right here, it should say download latest and then the patch. So you just want to click that. And uh, also it should say the MC, the Minecraft update. That should take you to AdFly. And uh, you just want to wait five seconds. And uh, don't pay attention to any ads down here. Uh, don't press anything. Just uh, right up here it should say skip ad after it's been five seconds. So just click there. And uh, that should download. So uh, once you've got that, just exit that and exit that. So you should be on MinecraftProjects.net. And you just want to go back. And that should take you to the forum again. And you want to go down again to download, and then if you want the fly mod, you're going to want to do this, so just download it. So press download for 1.6.4, just click that link, should take you to AdFly. You just want to wait 5 seconds, again, don't click anything down here, skip ad, and that should be downloading too. So once you've got them two, you want to locate your downloads, they're usually for Google Chrome just down here. And uh, for any browser, they usually just pop up. But uh, you just want to drag them to your desktop. And uh, don't worry if they're not like in in this form. They should probably be like a zip zip thing if you haven't uh, used the utility before. So I just want to exit this off. And uh, now you basically got the two mod files and you've installed WinRAR. So now what we want to do is we want to go into Minecraft and just make sure that we've ran run whatever we've ran the uh the normal minecraft to get all the files needed so we just want to uh, make there should be a profile here and you just want to go to edit profile make sure it's on the latest version you should have already done this if you play minecraft on 1.6.4 and you just want to press play and should download all the things but i've already done it because i play minecraft quite a lot and uh, once you've got all the files and it says Minecraft 1.6.4 up here, that means you're ready. So just press quit. And uh, what you want to do now is click, is hold the Windows key and R at the same time. And that should bring up this run application. And uh, where it says open, you just want to delete all of that and just put in, just put in this box here, percentage app data percentage. So percentage app data percentage, and then just press OK. That should bring you to your roaming folder, and you just want to look for Don't Minecraft should be at the top. It's an, if it's not, just search it. So just go into that, and uh, this is basically your Minecraft directory it has all your files and things. Uh, make sure not to delete anything because that could stuff up something. But you want to go into your versions folder, and uh, basically this should be your update you're on. If it's not, uh, you probably haven't ran the version, so uh, make sure to do that. And uh, if you don't have any folders here, that means you don't. You haven't run Minecraft before, so I'll make sure to do that. I just showed you how to do that. So uh, what you want to do once you've got this file is right-click, copy, and then right-click, paste. So we've just made a copy of the normal Minecraft, 
and uh, basically the copy is going to be made into a mod modded Minecraft. So what we want to do is we want to just rename this. So right click rename, and you want to just call this mods or X-ray. It doesn't really matter, and just press enter and uh, go into that. And you should have two files called 1.6.4, and you just want to highlight them both. Right click rename. And uh, you just want to rename them to the folder. You, yeah, you just rename them. So X-ray. So just right-click, rename, X-ray. Make sure it's exactly the same as the folder name. And uh, now you want to go into this JSON file. It should be like at the bottom. And uh, you just want to right-click, open with Notepad. And if it doesn't come up here, you can just go to Properties, where it says Opens with, just change, and uh, you know look for Notepad down here. Then press OK, and then you just want to open it. Uh, if if that doesn't work, you can just right-click open with Notepad. Okay. So once you've done that, you want to look for 1.6.4 in these in these quotation marks. Highlight 1.6.4, and you just want to delete that, and you want to replace that with X-ray or whatever you name these two files. And uh, now you just want to go File, Save, and you can exit that off. And in case you're OCD with like saving, you can just double click on it, check that it's X-ray, then just close it again. No one does that, but anyway. Uh, so now you want to open this with WinRAR the same way you open this with a notepad. So uh, what you want to do, again, right click, open with WinRAR, or go to Properties, go to Change, More Options, and then just find WinRAR. Then just press OK, and uh, that's the program we we installed before you can also use like 7-zip or anything that allows you to open zips so you just want to right click on that open with WinRAR you want to drag that to the side and you want to look for the folder meta-inf and uh, right click delete click yes and uh, also if you can't delete that then uh, that means that Minecraft's open so make sure to close it and uh, then you should be able to delete that so now once you've deleted meta-inf you want to open x-ray with WinRAR the same way we opened this x-ray.jar and uh, drag that to the side and you basically just want to add drag the x-ray the x-ray files into this new jar we made so you just want to click on any of the files and press Control a this will just highlight them all and you just want to drag them into here and you should get that add symbol and you just want to let go and then press ok so once you've done that you can install the fly mod now and remember again you need the x-ray mod in order for the fly mod to work so you can't just install the fly mod on its own. So once you've got the x-ray, you can go ahead and open the fly mod with WinRAR, the same way we did it before. And uh, again, just highlight any file, press Control a and drag them into here. You should get that plus symbol, add and replace, and press OK. So uh, now, basically, we've uh, installed the x-ray mod. Now all we have to do is add it to our Minecraft. So basically, we just copied the, uh, old, the normal Minecraft, and then we basically just customized it and uh, added these mods. So now you just want to exit that off, go into Minecraft. And uh, that's basically all the hard, hard stuff. So now you're basically done. You just want to go to a new profile and uh, you want to name this whatever. I'm going to call it mods x-ray. That doesn't matter at all. But the thing what does matter is where it says use version, uh, just click this click this arrow and uh, you should he see all the history Minecraft versions, the uh, the old ones and uh, you just want to look for release space and then the name you named the folder, the two files and the you know the JSON thing. So you just want to click there. So now we've made a new profile with the version x-ray which is the one we just made and uh, then you just want to press save profile and now basically the the normal one is just this one so the one you usually use and uh, this will basically just run the normal Minecraft. And then the other one we just made then, this will run the X-Ray. So if we want to run the X-Ray, just select it and press play. And uh, now basically we've installed it. So uh, if we go to single player, create a new world. Apologize for the loudness. You might not be able to hear that, but it's pretty damn loud. Okay, so uh, as you can see, it worked. So uh, you, s you can see the coordinates up there in the top left. And uh, if we press X, as you can see, cheating like a boss. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. 
this was my first video, so uh, don't forget to write, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you think of this video, since it's my first one. You know, give me feedback and stuff of what I could could have done better. And uh, yeah, see you guys later.